Hi, my name is Scott Strohs, and this is MySQL Shorts. There are some things we need before we can run this demo. First, we need an instance of MySQL running in AWS. Then, we need an instance of MySQL Heatwave running in Oracle Cloud. We need to have a storage bucket configured in Oracle Cloud. And finally, we need to have the OCI CLI installed. There'll be a link in the description on how to do that. We're going to use MySQL Shell to connect to our AWS instance. Here, we're using a user named Estros connecting to a host at AWS-MySQL, which is an alias in my host file, so I don't show you the IP address. And we're also connecting directly to a schema named MySQL Shorts. Now that we're connected, I'm going to run the slash SQL show schemas command so you can see the list of schemas that are available in this instance. Today, we're gonna to copy the MySQL Shorts database from AWS into OCI. We use util.dump schemas, and we pass MySQL Shorts as the only schema. Then we use shorts underscore dump as the folder name inside of the OCI storage bucket where the data will go. Then we use a config object that has OS bucket name with the name of the bucket we created, OCI MDS set to true because this data needs to be compatible with MySQL Heatwave. And then we specify that we want to use eight threads to do the dump. We can see information about the dump as it's being processed. Once everything's done, use backslash Q to quit this connection so we can connect to our MySQL Heatwave instance. There are several ways to connect to a MySQL Heatwave instance in Oracle Cloud. I prefer using a VPN. There's a link below to show you how to do that. We connect to our Heatwave instance using MySQL shell and a user named Estros. You can see the IP address is a private IP address, so I don't mind showing it to you here. To show that I'm not pulling any tricks, we're gonna run show schemas to list out all the schemas in this instance. Note, MySQL shorts is not there. To load the data, we use util.loaddump. We pass in the name of the folder that we created in our OCI bucket and a config object that has the schema, the OS bucket name, and the number of threads to use. Just as before, we'll see information in the console as the dump is being processed. I'm gonna run show schemas one more time, and you can see that MySQL shorts was imported into this instance of MySQL. For those counting at home, we use two commands to dump data from AWS into OCI and then restore that data into a MySQL Heatwave instance. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to hit like and subscribe. Also, there'll be a link in the description for any code or files we use during this video.